nobody else in my hood does art. Like I'm the only kid that that goes to or tries to like make some sort of art around. They call me a they call me a, a nerd sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Because I actually like paint and stuff, and nobody else like in the hood does that. Like, it's just kind of advertises a job for like city kids to just like come here, earn some money. They teach you a few skills and then you like go on and do whatever you want to do after here. You have to be extremely efficient. He's extremely efficient, I don't know about us. <laughs> Yo, I'm efficient bro, I just be lazy. You're efficient? I just be lazy bro. Yo, look at Anderson. Anderson doing that little, what's it called? Uh, <laughs> thank you, thank you. But no, quack up the Leo, my shit over there. Last year when I started, I went on three gigs in total. They were all on Fridays, and I got a, I got paid 150 each. And it was just like, like while they were doing their thing, maybe like two hour like event or whatever, I'd paint whatever they want me to paint. Yo, I run this studio, dog. Like everybody in the studio, I'm cool with. Like, like hold on. Yo, Eddie. <laughs> That's all I gotta say, man. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> that shit's crazy. You see this? You can pull that. It's been the block, 22 G's. I might have heard that. That's the album? No. It's a song? Yeah. Seven pack by the laundry man. That's what he says? <laughs> yeah. Seven pack by the laundry man. If I ever leave the hood, I ain't coming back. Ah. Don't you think you chose two really challenging colors for that? I didn't choose. Did you, you just wipe it on your pants? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yo, I'll just be doing it. <laughs> we can go to Doughboys and we can go to Teriyaki House. If you get chicken tired, you just can split with me, okay? All you do is down me, girl. Most of my family just is happy that I'm not out in the streets because my family is kind of, you know what I'm saying, we, we've we been in the hood for many centuries, you know what I'm centuries. saying, for centuries, dog, I've been in the hood for, centuries. for centuries, bro, and a lot of my family members have, have fallen into the gang substance of the streets, and they're just happy, you know what I'm saying, that I'm doing something else besides just being out, outside, doing what everybody else is doing. Oh, damn, First shot of the day, baby. <sighs> Yo, Anderson. Mwah. Keep me five. Keep it safe. Do you guys play like 21 or or 50 more? I play 50 more. I know That's a hood 50, game. But I know like Boston niggas play like 21 a lot. Hey, your foot's on the line. <laughs> you finally executed. I finally executed. A year ago, a US dollar was 42 pesos. Now it's 42. 50. Now it's 50. 42 pesos. Are you like trying to mock me? Nah, nah. I'm I'm just, I know my English is too <laughs> <bad>. <laughs> Nah, <laughs> your English is fine. I'm just 42 pesos. <laughs> Can't be a fucking model, dog. Come on now. Come on now. Yo, 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 come on now. Bro, you see these two close together. I'm honestly about to go home. Yo, do a backflip off the bed. I can't, bro. You're the only one that can. For the ready? Go ahead, buddy. Gang shit, gang shit. I'm the bang, though. Feel me? Hey. It's not gonna be easy but you're getting paid to do art. And it, this is an environment I want to be in, so, you know what I'm saying, I stuck with it.
School is stressful. This is peace. <laughs> peace on earth. I just want to be an artist. That's all I can do. <laughs> well, I'm good at like anything I'll pick up or anything I try to start and I have patience with it, but that's the, that's the cup of tea. Just like go and fill that shit up. Fill it up. That's it. Fill the whole goddamn thing up. That's it. Add some more white. Boom. And the mentors are really great. I have Moz. Anderson also has Moz. And Tavon has Jamil. But it is really nice, like, having people who know what you're doing or how to help you, especially, like, if it's in what you want to be or what you want to do. It's nice to see somebody who's, like, coming from the same place. point. I'm good. <laughs> Remember when we used to go to school here? Oh yeah. A throwback. And I still wouldn't come on time. Yeah. <laughs> even I did. It doesn't and matter I what distance I am. If I don't want to be somewhere, I won't go. I feel like art is also pretty self-sufficient. Like if you had to do it as a career, you're like doing it on your own. And I kind of like that independence. And also it's like really freeing because no one can tell you what is and isn't art. Where are we going? This is towards exit or red line. Uh, it's your choice, baby. Stop in the middle. <laughs> At regular schools, there's not that much when it comes to like art, especially like teaching art. The like last time I had maybe an art teacher was fifth grade. I just like to use it to understand my thoughts and feelings because sometimes I don't and sometimes I don't feel like reflecting verbally so this is like a better way to understand without like full confrontation but it's nice to like feel complete after I do a piece. But I feel like art is a big impact in my, in my life. I don't really have an emotional connection with it but I wouldn't say I'm, I'm gonna stop after AFH. My hopes is to get get to go to college. Nobody else in my family been to college and went through it, dog. I wanna be the first. I wanna do something where it doesn't feel like a job. Art still kinda feels like a job, but not like a job for myself. So I'd rather do art and be happy. It eats away.